Beetlejuice is the bright orange red star on Orion's right shoulder. When you see it, you're looking at light that left around the year 1385, when medieval knights were still riding into battle. It's massive, about 887 million miles or 1.43 billion kilometers across. If it were our sun, it would swallow Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, and Jupiter in its glow. The sun could fit inside more than a billion times. In late 2019, Betelgeuse dimmed more than 60%, a change visible without a telescope. At first, some thought that this was the star's final act. Astronomers discovered it was the result of an enormous eruption that blasted hundreds of quadrillions of tons of gas directly into space, more mass than Mount Everest multiplied by 10 million. That gas cooled into dust. It was a cloud the size of our solar system, briefly hiding the star's light from Earth. The blast even disturbed Betelgeuse's centuries-old heartbeat, its 400-day pulse falling out of rhythm. It was not the first time that humans noticed this star behaving strangely. In the late 1500s, Chinese court astronomers recorded Betelgeuse appearing brighter than any star in the sky, nearly as bright as Venus. Without telescopes, they tracked it by eye, using it as a seasonal marker for farming and navigation. Across cultures, its reddish glow became a guidepost for sailors as a sign of winter's arrival. Some traditions even read its changing color as a warning of storms or shifts in fortune. Today, Betelgeuse is fusing helium deep in its core. And when that fuel is gone, the core will ultimately collapse. And the star will explode into a supernova bright enough to see in daylight for weeks. At 640 light years away, it's not going to harm us. But it will be the brightest astronomical sight in living memory. Its name carries its own history. Betelgeuse comes from the Arabic Yad al meaning Hand of Orion. A single mistranslated letter centuries ago gave us the odd spelling that we use today. One day, the light from its death will begin. It'll take 640 years for it to reach us. And when it arrives, it'll be more than a spectacle. It will be proof that even the most brilliant lights in the sky have an ending. These are Interesting Things with J.C.